Yo, 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 what is going on guys, it's Cheese and Trees here, and welcome to Chapter 2, Episode 1 of this series on my channel, 100% and Grounded in 2024, WOMOD Edition. Before we get into this episode, I do quickly want to announce that I have started posting shorts here on YouTube, as well as created a TikTok account, both of which will feature short clips of only my most action-packed or funniest moments on this channel. So for those of you who want to see shorter clips of my content, you can look at my shorts here on YouTube, and I'll put the link to my TikTok in the description. If you're joining right now for the first time, we're starting Chapter 2, which means you missed Chapter 1. So click on this video up top to start catching up on the series. But right now, in this episode, I venture into the sandbox for the first time and take on a couple of new enemies that I haven't defeated before. So without further ado, enjoy the video. And the ant parts... A couple. Alright, I'm gonna wear the ladybug armor. I'm still gonna use the sword and shield, the black ant sword and shield. I need to kill some black ants to um, repair them, though. Open this door. And voila, we got the zipper. And. Some beautiful upgrade rocks and some brat bursts. Zipper, go up. Woo! <laughs> oh, yeah, we still need to get the black ant shovel. Oh, we just need grub hide. Have mandibles in the head. All right. Get some grubs. Just need one grub, I think. Shovel. Place my acorn shovel. Bye-bye. All right, we're gonna head to the sandbox. Uh, but on the way to the sandbox is the picnic table Ant where I'll find a couple black ants so I can repair my uh, sword and shield. I don't have any tufts. I'm gonna grab some tips. I wonder if I could keep that aphid as a pet. Got 14, that's pretty good. To the shovel. There it is. I found the shovel. I want no problems, Mr. B. No problems. But since you want problems, I'll give them to you. Any ants up here? Oh, there need... Okay, I was going to say there need to be ants up here. I need them. Ow, he hurts. Come here, little ant. I need your parts. You too. Hey, you too. I need your parts. Ow. Oh, what? Okay. I thought I was about to go under the picnic table or something. Okay. Two more. I need two more pots. Oh. I'm dumb dumb. I never connected the zip line. Well. I need silk rope. Time to go back. Whee! Alright, I got the silk rope. Trying to figure out if I should sleep so I avoid the wolf spiders. All right, let's sleep. All right, here they are. All tucked in with the outfits and backpacks they were snatched in. As requested, they're strapped and synced with scabbies for whatever they might run into down there. You do realize the director will have our heads if he finds out we're removing company property? Can you sleep at night with what this company's doing? We need to do something. Is Dr. Tully even alive? The field team reported him missing months ago. You are prolonging the inevitable. Wendell, wherever he is, is the only hope for these kids. I'll make the delivery to his yard discreetly. No one is even going to know. I hope you know what you're doing. Vision is complete. I now know the origin of the briefcase and how Tiny Pete came to be. They 
things are sort of maybe just a little bit making some sense. And knowledge is a beacon in the dark, brave traveler. Things are making sense. Looks like they didn't want to terminate me like Schmechter wanted. And so they just dropped me off in Dr. Tully's yard, hoping that I would survive. So at least they were some good scientists, but uh, can't say the same for Schmechter. All right, now that we have our silk rope and we can go across the zip line, now we can go to the sandbox. Also, I probably have some milk molars I can spend from the black ant hill. That spider over there scared me. The heck is it fighting? Gosh, that spider, man, that scared the crap out of me. That spider's sleeping and moving at the same time. Look at him go. All right, well, we're back to the picnic table. You just gotta get up to the top up there, to the book. Hey, I did it. Oh. I spot Mark that one off the list. Slashing and salty. Okay, so the ant sword is definitely the one I want to use. If it doesn't break. Oh, I don't have parry master on anymore. I need to put that back on. Yeah, I definitely need parry master. Let's go, I got an antlion part. I got two of them. All right, let me change my mutations real quick. Uh, yeah, maybe not. Maybe after this one? Pincer, let's go. All right, we'll go from cardio fan and get parry master. There we go. Okay, I do have enough black ant parts to repair one of these two. I'm gonna repair the sword, and if my shield breaks, my shield breaks. So now I need three black ant parts, and I can repair my shield. If I can't, then I can't, but at least I have a full sword. I'm sizzling. Sizzle on the sand. Sizzle on the sand. Yeah, Perry Master is clutch. I went from like no stamina to full stamina. So as long as I can find shade, I'll be okay. There's shade along the edge. Right, if I go here? Yeah. Okay, so I just gotta s stay with my back against the wall, I guess. I can go out for a little bit. Not too long, though. I need to eat something. I don't even have food, I don't think. No! Almost had him. Oh, he broke my shield. At this point, I was getting hungry, and I forgot to bring food with me to the sandbox. Luckily, there was a cookie sandwich close by that I could munch on. I went to analyze the antlion parts that I had found, along with a fresh cookie sandwich bit. Analyzing those antlion parts allowed me to learn how to craft a full armor set that provided sizzle protection and a great sword. The extreme heat in the sandbox was making me thirsty as well, but I had just gotten there and I wasn't ready to leave yet. Yeah. Got one pincer and two parts, baby. Is there... I can go by that shovel if I can make it. I don't know if I can make it, though. Under that leaf. 
gonna try and go under that leaf, but I don't know if I'll make it. Go, 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 go! Under the leaf! Under the leaf! Whew! I made it. Now to the shovel. Alright, now to the shovel. Go, go, go! This is a spot right here. Oh, there's a lab. Lab outpost. That kind of looks like a popsicle. I get the feeling it's not refreshing, though. <laughs> Look what I found, though. Sandbox burgle chip. That's money. We got some research. We got a sand castle with a treasure chest. I feel like this is trying to tell me something. There's an X right there. Is that where I find the key to the treasure? The shadow of the shovel. So it's wherever the shadow is. Uh, the shadow is gone. There is no shadow. Okay. So is that three thirty? Unless it, unless this is the hour hand, which would mean it's six fifteen. But I don't think there's what. There's not gonna be a shadow at six fifteen. Wow, I don't have any water. I used all my water because the sandbox is just a straight desert. But yeah, that's what I'm going with. You gotta find where the shovel shadow is at 3.30. I'm just gonna jump off and hope I don't die. Because I forgot my dandelion tuft. For some reason I left it at home. I didn't die, but I might if I don't find water. Oh my gosh. If I drink this, will I survive? It worked. I'm sick, but uh, it worked. All right. Well, this time, I'll come prepared. And... All right. Well, while I'm home, I'm going to make the wide brim and the poncho. I don't have enough parts for the spurs. I need four more parts for the spurs. I'm also gonna wanna make the great sword. So I'm gonna need more parts for the great sword and a bunch of pincers. Oh yeah, not only do I need to craft them, I need to upgrade them. Sandbox. No sizzle, baby. Wait, is that a black ant? Black ant working away yes. here. Yay! No! I'm stupid! I left my black ant parts at the house, so I need three more. Nope. Nope. Go away. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Go away, go away, go away. Go away. Go. Here, you fight the wolf spider. The spider's just stuck. Go away. Go after the antlion. Go after the antlion. Oh my god. Go after the spider. Yes. Y'all fight each other. Yes! Get him, antlion. Get him! No! I wonder if I can kill him now that he's so low health. It'll be my first wolf spider. I'm gonna try. Hopefully he didn't heal up. He did a little bit. Yes! Get him! No! Yes! I got him! <laughs> I got a mutation from it too. Mithridatism. Let's go. I could use something to drink. We got spider venom. Nice and clean. Ooh. And spider fangs. Let's go. It worked. It worked. <laughs> Suck on that, wolf spider.
I continued running around the sandbox fighting all the ant lions and black ants that I could find. I gathered all the loot that I could and found an oasis with a field station so I could research the fangs and venom from the wolf spider. It was about time to head back home with the loot, but before I did, there was one more challenge to take on. Okay, let's try these guys in the pit that throw the ants at you. These guys are definitely stronger. <laughs> do it, but they're strong, man. Ah, too early. No! Oh, I'm out of bandies! I have one smoothie left. I'm gonna have to get some bandies. Okay, come on. Oh, no! Last smoothie. No, I have half health and that was my last smoothie. We got him! We stunned him! Let's go, baby! Yeah! Whoa! <laughs> okay. What's that? Oh, gosh. Come here, I can't see. At least these guys are a little easier, but I don't have any bandies, so I can't mess up. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh. I'm almost dead. Come on, die. I need you to die. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, if there's any more down here, I'm going to be so sad. What's this? Oh, Supreme Court side. I can't get that yet. But a Mega Molar, I can get that. Let's go. All right. Now that I had used all my heels, I grabbed the Milk Molar out of the lunchbox and headed home to craft a bunch of bandages and a few smoothies as well. While I was there, I decided to sleep even though it was morning time because I was sick from drinking that nasty water from earlier and I had to sleep it off. Before heading back to the sandbox, I crafted the antlion greatsword and upgraded it to level 5 to make easier work of the antlions. Oh, this pieces them a lot faster. Look at that. Get him, black ant. Get him. Oh, I died. I suck. Oh my gosh, this great sword is amazing. Whoop, down we go again. Oh, I can't use a torch. There we go. Get stuck. Oh, come on. I ran out of stamina now. There we go. <laughs> Make sure there's no more ants down here before I start looting. There it is. There's one right here. Let's go. Okay. I think we're good. Get these salt clusters. Thirty-eight salt from that. That's crazy. That's so much salt. Bam. The ant lions are getting easy already. There's nothing down here. Wait, is this a 
This is where I was. This is... Okay. This is a two-way tunnel. There you go. I got him. He hit me a little bit, but I got him. Ooh. We got some good stuff down here. We got more salt, first of all. All right. So now we have 40 salt. Holy moly. We got mint. We got sturdy marble. And we got more of these hot cha-cha candies. Get these spicy shards, baby. Eight spicy shards. Let's go. Ow. Oh, that was no bueno. Alright. That was sloppy. Ooh, I got Blade Master. That was sloppy, but we did it. Take off Natural Explorer and put on Blade Master. Now we should kill him even faster. We got soda, we got more salt, more marble, and more hot cha cha. Oh, I can't see. Let's go. So easy. I continued clearing the sandbox of antlions, and before I knew it, it was time to go deposit my loot again. While I was at home, I crafted the final piece of antlion gear, the spurs, and upgraded them to level 5. While I was on my way back to the sandbox, I embarrassingly died to bees, which almost caused my antlion sword to break. Of course that would happen right after I deposited all my loot. Don't burn your feet, Pete! <sighs> Look at this sizzle not going up. Oh, I love this armor. Oh, this is awesome. Wait, what's this? Oh, that's what the shovel's for. Have I not seen those yet? Ominent Practical Technologies, Dr. Wendell Tolley, Science Division, Log 88.05.29G. Oh, or is that... H. H for safety. It was arrogant, as always. Dismissing my breakthroughs and covalent spacing reduction. Questioning the very use of shrinking technology. <laughs> what a ridiculous lack of vision. World hunger, overpopulation, global warming, just the tip of the iceberg. Is that Wendell's intern? You have interns out here? I'm, I'm a little confused on that one. I have one part, and I need three parts and one pincer. All right, well, let's try and figure this out real quick. This is why I'm really here. Anyway, I'm going to say that that is either... Here, let's do this. Either 3 o'clock or 3.30. Because I don't think there's a shadow at 6.15. I'm I think it's saying that I'm supposed to dig at the shadow, because X marks a spot for treasure, right? Like, that's my interpretation of it. I just dug up that scientist. So I'm assuming that at the shovel out here, right here, at 3.30, I'm supposed to dig right here. It is 1.50. So, you just need to make sure we're here at 3.30. There's buried treasure. And there, deep within the trackless wastelands, oh, the wow. small Pete found an ancient treasure that would shortly interesting, aid his quest. Interesting uh, loot from that treasure. Oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. I almost missed it. Okay, we gotta get this and go back to the shovel. Oh, I got a hot cha cha charm. Oh, I really want to fight you, Antlion, but I also really 
don't want to miss out on this treasure. It's burning. I don't want to wait a whole nother day. All right, we got like 15 minutes before it shows up. Watch it. Watch me be like completely wrong. Wait. Wait. It's 3.30. Well, it's 3.29, but it's 3.30. Oh my goodness. I found it. The melted moat key. All right. Let's go figure out what to do with it. So it says the key to the treasure chest is under the castle. Which I haven't been over to the castle yet. I, I kind of like saw the water and... Yeah, I, I didn't want, I, I just went under this, uh, or wait, did I go under here? I don't even know if I went under here. Okay, I didn't go under here, obviously. I got the science. Let's go. Oh. I found a treasure chest. And it's kind of under the castle. Wait. Oh, it's a piece of paper. Waterlogged recipe. I got a recipe. Salt Morning Star, let's go! We got it. The Morning Star of Salt. Alright, there it is. Salt Morning Star. We need salt globs and gum nuggets and tough gunk. Well, I've never seen tough gunk. I need to figure out how to get salt globs. Oh, antlion. Well. That was unfortunate timing. Couldn't block because I didn't have any weapon out. Come on, give me a pincer. I need a pincer. Yes, that's exactly what I needed to repair my sword. Let's go. Exact parts that I needed to repair my sword. All right, well, we found the treasure. Well, now that I think of it, I found that uh, chip in the sandbox. So I do need to give Burgle that chip. All right, Burgle. Nice I got a chip for you. Can I help you today? Ah, more chips. Thank you. All right, sandbox chip. Sandbox chip. I'm going to take all this stuff. If I don't take it now, I'll never take it. ASL. ASL. Let's do multimolars real quick. We will do our consumable stack size. And then science shop. Globs. Mighty glob. Advanced smithing up. Brittle upgrades. Blue masher. We, we're getting a lot of stuff right now. Okay. Advanced production buildings. We got all this stuff. I like cookbooks, so we'll get the sandbox cookbook. Acorn turret sounds fun. And we'll get the waft emitter. That was plenty of stuff. There's our salt glove that we were looking for. So many new ideas. Let's go. Salt glob oven. So we need sturdy whetstone and salt shards, which we can easily get sturdy whetstone. And we need an oven, it looks like. Okay. So how do we get an oven? Over here, probably. Oven. Alrighty, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Right here, we've got some scenes from our next episode where I head to grab some charcoal so we can craft that oven, which allows me to craft the Salt Morning Star, along with a couple other amazing weapons that I'll be using a lot of in the near future. Don't you guys forget that episodes are coming out every single week, and you are not going to want to miss them. Thank you so much for joining me in this series, and I will see you guys in the next one.